In our first news today, the government of India approved the production linked incentive PLI scheme for manufacturing advanced chemistry cell ACC battery and allocated a budget of 18,100 crore rupees. With the objective to promote the Make in India initiative, the National Program on Advanced Chemistry Cell is expected to attract foreign and domestic investment of 45,000 crore rupees. The scheme main objective is to achieve manufacturing of 50 gigawatts of battery storage. Definitely, it will boost up electric vehicles in India. In our second news today, the government of Meghalaya introduced its new EV policy 2021. The highlights of the EV policy are no registration fees and road tax for all types of electric vehicles, 10,000 rupees subsidy on electric two-wheelers for the first 3,500 electric two-wheelers, 4,000 rupees per kilowatt hour subsidy on electric three-wheelers for the first 200 vehicles purchased and 4,000 rupees subsidy per kilowatt hour on electric car purchase for the first 2,500 vehicles. In our third news today, Omega Siki Private Limited announced a strategic partnership with Log9 Materials introducing rapid charging batteries for its Rage Plus electric autos. The batteries will be first introduced in Rage Plus 2 variants which is having a battery capacity of 5.8 kWh and a 6.5 kWh. With the new log -in material batteries, it will take 30 minutes and 35 minutes to charge these batteries respectively. The battery packs will have a 15-year warranty from log -in materials. And both these electric autos can operate in temperatures between minus 40 degrees and plus 65 degrees, making them perfect for Indian road conditions. log -in materials offering 15,000 charge cycles with a range of 65 to 100 kilometers on a full charge. In our fourth news today, the UK logistics company Fast Dispatch to launch its logistic services with 600 electric vehicles in India. Initially, the company plans to launch its services in cities like Bengaluru, Delhi NCR and Hyderabad. Later, it plans to expand its services Pan India by December 2021 with a vehicle fleet of 15,000. Go Green, Go Electric.